Hello guys, in this video I am going to introduce you to Lepton AI. We will see what Lepton AI is and we will also run a demo by installing it on our local machine. In very simple words, Lepton AI or Lepton Simple is Python library that allows you to build an AI service from Python code with ease. With Lepton AI, you get a Pythonic abstraction which is also called as Photon and I will describe it in more detail later on that allows you to convert research and modeling code into a service with a few lines of code. It also provides you simple abstraction to launch models like those on Hugging Face in few lines of code. It also comes up with pre-built examples for common models such as Llama, STXL, Whisper and other and you can get all of these models from the Lepton's website. I will also drop the link to this in video's description. And then you can of course get any other uh, job too like batching or background jobs with the Lepton and you also get a client to automatically call your service like native Python functions. Okay, now enough theory, let me launch my local system and I'll be using my Ubuntu system for it. Let me quickly log in you, log in there and show you my Ubuntu release, what I'm using for this demo. So you can see that I'm using Ubuntu 22.04. Let me clear my screen. Let me make a directory called as Lepton, cd to Lepton. And now in order to install the Lepton here, the command and procedure is very simple. First step, all you need to do is to do uh, pip install dash capital U Lepton AI and that is going to install the Lepton on your local system as you can see here. Shouldn't take too long. The U option ensures that you are installing the latest version of Lepton AI. If you want to keep the current version then just omit dash capital U. Okay so that is done. Now just to check if it has installed correctly or not just to lep dash dash help and there you go so there you go so our Lepton AI is installed this is how easy it is to get it installed now Lepton uses a concept of a photon to bundle the code to run an AI model its dependencies and other miscellaneous contents loosely speaking you can view it as a docker container but it's much more lightweighted and tailored for AI so now let's create a photon for GPT-2 model, which is an old model, but that will serve our purpose here. In order to run GPT-2 model, all you need to do is to run this command, lep photon create. Photon's name is uh, my GPT-2 and model is GPT-2 from Hugging Face. Press enter. And there you go. So it has installed easily. Now in order to run it, all you need to do is to run something like lep photon run and my gpt2 and local means that we are running it locally you can also run it on the cloud version of lepton ai which you can sign up and use there you go so it is loading the model locally hopefully it should fit on my system because it's not that huge i guess yep so you can see that the tensor are just 548 Mac. I have one GPU of 16 GPU of VRAM on this local system. So hopefully should be able to access it. Let's wait for it to finish. Okay, so I would need to install Jinja 2. I need to upgrade it so let me quickly upgrade it so first let's check what is the Jinja 2's current version okay 3.03 .03 and I need to upgrade it so I'll just say pip install Jinja 2 dash dash upgrade let's wait for it to upgrade it Okay, so that is done and now let me run that photon again. So there you go. So this time it ran perfectly fine. As you can see here, here we updated it 
and now it is running on my local system which you can easily access okay now as lepton a is running locally the model on our system let's go to another uh, terminal and try accessing this model through a python code so i have opened a new putty window to the same um, lepton ai let me show you one python script which i have created so in this python script all i'm doing i'm saying from lepton ai import client url because it is running locally client url this is a url and then i'm just passing it this prompt once upon a time so let me run it python 3 test.py let's wait there you go so it has created the completion that once upon a time I, this is what i gave and it is just doing it's your friend job to wait for a blind day to show up okay then it is just simply um, putting it in and if i take you back to our other party screen you should see some sort of tokens being generated there you go so you can see that uh, it is doing something get and post comments are being served by this photon amazing stuff let's try out one more to see how it goes so let me vi test and then let me go here small i just delete it just say which one came first go chicken let's save it colon w key and now let's run it okay so it says <laughs> okay i don't know what they're they saying that but it is totally going off but anyway so you can see that uh, you can use a lot of other models because gp2 is very old and you can't really rely on that one there are llama 2s and there are a lot of hugging face models which you can use by this and then as i uh, even you can use a mixed troll 8 into 7 billion llama 2 7 billion and actually let me show you that so there you go so you can use mixed troll llama 2 mixed troll is here and then um, prompt llm llama to 70 billion 13 billion 7 billion and even some of the model from stable diffusion so pretty cool i would say uh, and then as i mentioned earlier you can even go with their cloud version if you don't want to host it locally host you know doing the cloud version is simply fairly easy all you need to do is to sign up and then create that photon and then you can start doing it because so for example if you want to do the stable diffusion and if you need a beefy gpu and if you don't have it locally then you can simply take advantage of their cloud offering and you already have seen that how easy it is to use these models locally just from your python code that's it guys i hope that you enjoyed it if you are already using it let me know your experience and if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed, please share it among your network as it helps a lot. Thanks for watching.